Alright, in this tutorial I'm going to be making a platform game using CS5. Doesn't matter what you have as long as you have Action Script 2. So click on that. Go down to layers down here and make three new layers. I'm going to just name them Character, Ground, and VCAM. Now go to Character and make your character. Alright, once you have your character, you're going to want to highlight it, make sure you're on the character later, right click, go to convert symbol, make sure the registration is on the bottom, and name it character, or whatever, it doesn't matter. Now, once you do that, put your character off to the side over there lock the layer and go to ground now to make your ground I'm just going to go to rectangle tool and I'm just going to make boxes for the ground but make sure your stroke is on like four or five because it will prevent glitching from you'll see later alright so there's my ground basic now what you're gonna wanna do is highlight all your ground make sure the character is locked so you can just go like that and all your grounds highlighted and your character isn't now right click on your ground go to convert symbol name it ground and make sure your registration is on the top and you gotta make sure the character and the ground is on movie clip click OK. Now once you got the ground and your character you're gonna wanna unlock your character click on it click on your character and go to instant name and name it CHR then you're gonna wanna go to your ground name the instant name ground now once you got that you wanna click on your character right click go to actions and then this should pop up you're gonna wanna go to my dis to the uh, description and it'll have on clip event and all of this stuff including these two little things highlight it copy and then paste into here what this does is it's gonna make your character be able to move and stuff you get X out of that now if you click control enter my character could just go off the screen and then you don't know where he went now to make it so it follows him you want to go to your vcam layer go to the link in my description download vcam it's free nothing wrong with it once you download it you're gonna to want to go to your start windows and type into the search program files and type in vcam should be here or you could just <clears throat> if you don't have the search tool if you use an XP uh, you could just find it by going up and just looking for it double click on it and then it should open up a new window over here and this is what it should look like there's your project here and then VCAM should look like this. So you want to right click on it, click copy, go to this one, click paste into pa place. Not paste, just paste into place. And then this should show up. It's going to be on the VCAM layer. So once you have that, you could X out of this, you could X out of this right here. But then you still have this here. You want to double click somewhere where there's nothing but inside the box like over here double click and then this should come above everything else now you want to click on these little tiny things so click on one and then click backspace and do that for all of them just backspace with all of them and also that gradient bar and then click on this like the site looking thing 
double click so you highlight all that and then backspace on that that little X right there you want to keep there so don't delete that now once you have that you can double click out of it and now right click go to actions you want to right click just somewhere on the white part you don't want to right click there or else that will go to the ground layer you want to click over here so it stays on the vcam layer just somewhere in the white go to actions and then from my description highlight the on clip event y x and that little symbol thing copy then paste it onto actions x out of it now if you hit control enter the camera now follows my character now as you saw right there whenever i fall down i don't like restart or anything so we're gonna make a restart box so once you fall it'll go right back down watch ready if i fall like here i just keep on going down so what you have to do is make a new layer I'm just gonna name it rb for restart box you want to zoom out to about 25 percent make a square going all the way across like that highlight the square right click I can't see it on the screen but go to convert symbol make sure the registration is on top I'm just gonna name it RB for restart box now once you have that you wanna double click on your restart box so you go into it and then you wanna go to the paint bucket and stroke click on it and you can't see it but where it says alpha here then it says percentage you wanna click on the percentage and bring it down to zero and click enter and do the same here it's off the screen you can't see it, it says alpha I'm just gonna make it zero click enter now what that does is if you double click outside the box you you are inside the box just double click somewhere out here and then you should see like this blue line but now it's transparent now you want to right click on it go to actions and then in the description you want to highlight everything for the reset symbol copy paste it into actions now where it says char x you want to hit space equal sign and then char y space and then what you want to do is you want to go up double click on your character where it says x and y Hot, click on the x right click click copy and then go down try to find your restart box uh, uh, you need to double click out of your character click on your restart box go where it says X click on it click space then paste it there then go back up to your character click on the Y copy then go down find your restart box click here space then paste now you can X out of that and once you hit control enter if I fall off ah oh, see now right there I was glitching so what you want to do is go back to your restart box actions and you want to just change these around like I'm gonna make this minus 14 and this 200 instead X out of that now I'm gonna try All right, I'm still glitching off so what you wanna do is just try messing around so it doesn't glitch off so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna go into this and I'm gonna just move it over a little hit control enter alright that's why I'm restarting like right there so I wanna move it over some more
Alright, so if I fall off, I start there. Now I'm not glitching. It's not like glitching off. You just want to test it in all spots because sometimes it may not glitch off here, but it may glitch off like further on. Now, right now it seems good. Alright. So once you have that, you have your restart box. You're then going to want to make a new layer. Then name it Spikes. You want to go into your VCAM layer, make a new layer, name it HP. Double click out of it. Now I'm going to show you how to make HP, which is going to be a health bar up there, and Spikes to hurt your uh, character so you could lose health, and a lose screen in my next tutorial.